Hello everybody, welcome back to another GTA 5 car build. This time we're going to be doing the Lampadati Tropos Rally, which is actually pronounced Tropo. And this is obviously a Lancia Stratus. And honestly, this is one of my favorite cars in this game. Sheerly because of its design. It's one of the nicest looking, like, proper rally cars that this game has to offer. But... As much as I know rally cars are supposed to have liveries on them, I'm going to take off this livery as soon as I can. Yep, livery. Jesus, it costs a lot to get a new livery on this. And respray it to the color I want, which has to be red. It just look it just seems like it'd be perfect in red. Now here's the real I think I kind of like it in cavernet red for some reason. What about garnet? I'll go with cavernet red. Usually whenever I look at cavernet red it's like a little too fruity. Like it looks like apple, but it actually looks good on this car. Alright, now, brakes, I don't put armor on, this is online, engine, exhaust, chrome tip, and titanium tuner, I'll go with the chrome tips, uh, grill, rally fogs, um, no, actually wait, I want to try something, if I go to lights, and change it basically. I'm keeping these yellow because oh, uh, they go back down. Thought they'd stay up since uh, I put them there. I'd like to see if these worked, but I, I'm not gonna get them. Hood, vented hood. Yeah, why not? Put little extra vents on there. Go with the clown horn. Uh, no lights, no livery. I've already got this covered. Oh, there's a roof option? Unpainted louvers. That actually does provide a nice contrast. I'll put it on. Spoiler. Remove roof spoiler. Extended spoiler. Go with the remove roof spoiler option. Transmission and turbo. Lights back on the windows and wheels. Quick disclaimer about all of the off-road, or not off-road, uh, online builds that I will be doing. I will be choosing off-road Raider wheels all the time. This yeah, is the type of rim I use I'm online because about. it improves performance when it comes to grip. I don't do that in story mode because I don't really care about its performance later on, but I'm going to race with these cars online, so every time I do a car online, you'll see me put on these rims. Alrighty. Let's take this thing for a spin. This is a, such a beautiful car. The only thing that really sets it back is it's understeer. It's got a slight understeer. It sounds so beautiful as well. It feels great to drive this thing. It's been a while since I've driven it. And to buy it and fully upgrade it, it costs about a million flat. So now I've got about sorry, I've got about two million in game. Or not two hundred thousand in game I believe, yeah. It's gonna be a while until I get the next car, which for online the next car I want's the Tempesta. I ran over a prostitute, sadly. It'll not that'll make this driving experience a little less flawless, but no damage to the car, so it doesn't matter. It's such a nice car, this. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you guys in the next build.